It's because I bought like 15 pairs of pants. Hello, so I am in Mauritius. My month of travel has been insane and I'm so grateful. Like it's just, it's so surreal, the, the opportunities that the internet has given me. So I'm now in Mauritius. I had one day after Antigua to pack, not even one day, I got home on the Wednesday, left on the Thursday afternoon. So yeah, after 20 hours of traveling, 21 hours maybe, flight to Paris, then a flight to Mauritius, I'm here. And I'm with a completely different group. I know three of the people, which is great. And it's a very different vibe to where I've just been. I think these, these social situations, they definitely make you think about how you respond. I think it's part like, part of it is, like a huge part is dealing with the social situation of being with people you don't know, being with them a lot. And yeah, there's a lot of group dynamics and things that are quite interesting. I might have to reflect on this when I'm home. But I'm here in Mauritius. It's beautiful. We're in the Attitude um, Ravenella Hotel. So this is with Attitude Hotels. It's a really cool hotel brand. I've been here for like two days. First, I'm gonna show you all the clips that I've been filming so far. So I've got the hotel. We also went to see some horse racing. That's quite a big deal here. And I had a look around Port Louis. Oh my God, I love all this detail. I love all the beautiful handicraft. So intricate. And this chair, I kind of want to take this chair home with me. Yoot. Let's step out onto the balcony. Look at my hammock. I'm gonna chill on my hammock. I'm gonna see view. Oh my God. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Sorry, I don't take pictures. <laughs> <laughs> no photos. <laughs> no photos, please. I just thought I'd show you a bit more of the hotel. This is the dining area. I think there's like 10 restaurants. We're going to win, aren't we? Absolutely. We're going to win. win. We We're going to win. <laughs> We're all going to win. Did you say Brexit? <laughs> but we have chicken, which is very marinated with turmeric. We need onion, tomato, curry leaves, garlic, and uh, ginger paste, turmeric powder. Curry powder, this is chili as per your taste, and this is thyme. And here is some uh, coriander leaves, fresh coriander leaves, and uh, chives. This is for garnishing. For viewers, nice, but uh, I think the first one is the best. horse racing. Well, we're not going to be racing horses ourselves, but we're going to watch it. It's quite a big deal here. We're all dressed up. It is hot. Oh my gosh. Hot, 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 hot. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We're buying some bags. Euro 5? Yep. Yesterday, I walked up to the wrong group of people and it was, I was just like, okay. Bye. Doing that see ya kind of meme, I, I was just not with it. I even went to the wrong room and tried to get in. I was like, oh my God, I've messed up the key. Wrong room. <laughs> so yeah, it's a really cool hotel brand. I think it's all inclusive, but they really want you to get out and experience the local culture. So you can do a cookery class. You can dine with a local family. Like there's so many experiences that they want you to have here. And the culture is really interesting. Like. I guess it's Mauritius's class is part of Africa, but it's quite a multicultural population. I was up like, I shouldn't have even been up. I was literally just Googling Creole because I thought Creole was one language, but it's like, there's lots of different types of Creole languages. It's, it's mind blowing basically. The history that has led to this point is, you know, very sad, but it's, it's mind blowing. And yeah, it's made me think a lot. I'm gonna have to reflect on this properly, but 
I'm here, everyone's been so friendly, and we're going on a boat. So now we're packing to go to a different hotel. I should have left like half an hour ago. <laughs> what is this? Oh, why do I bring so much stuff? And I've also bought two of these bags. They're so cool. Curry for breakfast, it had to be done. I've got some puree, veg curry, this is so good, and rice. And then I've got my sweet course, my crepe, and pineapple <laughs> syrup and cinnamon sugar. Oh, thank you. Wow. I think they've got us some drinks and snacks. Oh, my, we're, gonna be, we're being so spoiled. We're spoiled. <laughs> For the fruit. I'm about to try a curry cocktail. It's got curry leaves. I can't smell anything. Maybe I have, I have a blocked nose, but I'm sure it smells very nice. Ooh, interesting. Mm. Is there alcohol in it? It's not alcohol. It's not. Okay, so a curry cocktail without alcohol. This is our boat. We've got a singing man on the boat. He's singing. This lunch. Oh my god, okay, falling on the lunch. But it looks so good. So excited. Glass coffee. <laughs> coffee and cake. Oh my god, they keep feeding us. I'm so happy. So this is the Hotel Juan de Mer. Just stopped off briefly. This is cool. A little explorer kit. I've already bought a basket or two. They're all made from this kind of plastic. It's really interesting. Made it to the attitude Zilwa and I'm in love. It's so cool. So this is room number two. It is so sweet. Slightly different vibe. Oh god, okay, just crashing into things. Really love the sink, it's extra large. That'll be good for doing makeup because I can open this and I've got this mirror. And then we've got this lovely shower. Very nice. Lou will be in there. They've also given me some flip flops. And yeah, I love that everything is made, like the baskets are made from the same material. Got some macaroons, oh my God. I'm so excited, so excited. So I've just had a shower and freshened up. We're now gonna go to dinner with a local family. So the hotel actually facilitates this for any of their guests. So you can have an authentic Mauritian experience. I think the families we go to, they, they actually work for the hotel, so I'm gonna be excited about the food. I think it's gonna be like my third curry-related thing of the day. I'm so excited. This is where we're having dinner this evening. <gasps> when says guests to our place, we welcome them like this. We say the guest is our goal. Alors, quand il y a les clients chez nous, on l'accueille comme ça, on dit les clients sont les dieux. Alors, vous êtes tous, vous êtes les clients. Alors, vous êtes les dieux pour nous aujourd'hui. This one? Yeah, what is it? We call it gato pima. Oh, okay. And then this one? This one badja. Nice. Mm. I'm gonna try this now. Okay. This sauce is so good. Mm. Mm -mm. Okay, yeah, put it. It's fine you put it in the pot. Oh, no? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's uh, good. Oh, well done. Mm. Well, that's well done. Well done. We're gonna do some cycling. 
these are the sweaty mess. I actually put makeup on this morning. I had to take it off because we were cycling. It is really hot, really humid. We're using electric bikes for the first time and they are an experience. Not used them before. I don't know. I'm just worried the bike's going to go and I'm still on it or off it or chucked off it. But yeah, I'm hopefully going to do the next bit. I had to get a car, like they had to drop me off in the car to, um, you know, the first meeting point, And now I'm hopefully going to cycle for myself. Okay. Okay. So we're okay. We're going left. Left, left, left. Left, left, left. Oh, these bags. Oh my God. Can I buy a bag? These bags. Look, can I take a picture of the bags? Can I take a picture? Yeah. Can I take a picture? Oh my God. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. Oh my God. I've just discovered this shop of basket bags. It is so cool. Now we've just stopped at Hindu temple over here. So I just about survived the cycle. You know, maybe, maybe I skipped a few bits. Normally I don't, but I just I have a fear of electric bikes like ever since I went to Copenhagen and had that issue on the higher bikes I just I just have a fear of electric bikes and not being able to control it and not knowing what it's going to do so yeah I don't know I think I just got a bit scared we moved off oh god this is going to do that isn't it I think I have to get safety pins you know the thing about off the shoulder dresses they look great but they're always blowing up um, and I'm late we only had about 20 minutes to get ready so I had another shower it's a good thing I brought like 15 pairs of pants we're now heading to lunch on an island okay we're getting coconut with rum oh my god I'm so excited I've not had any of these since Jamaica last year so this is my lunch so we have been here all afternoon now it's time to go it's so sad everyone's getting their last bits of content content I stupidly I did not charge my drone. Such an idiot. This is the same island, but in the evening we've got a party island. Oh, you're a party island. Yes. Our last dinner is insane. There's so much food. I have to show you the seafood. Hopefully you can see the prawns. And then we've got lots of little crunches. We've got some fish and oysters. More fish. This is like a giant fish. Ooh. Hello, so it is our last day in Mauritius. Uh, I need to tie this up because <coughs> I love washing my hair in tropical countries because then it just dries really quickly. So that's what I've done because it's the last day. <laughs> so, yeah, it's our last day. I think we're gonna go to another one of the Attitude Hotels. So I don't know if I've spoken to you about the brand, but they seem very integrated in Mauritian culture. I mean, it's Mauritian owned, so not foreign owned. You know, they always try and give back to the local communities, even the gift shops, like apparently they don't take profits from the gift shops. I don't know if the other day you saw that we dined with Rani, so you can dine with a local family if you're a guest here. And yeah, that family gets all the all the money, I think. So it just seems like a really, you know, heartwarming brand. And they want you to have an authentic experience. Like there's lots of Creole on the walls. Creole languages are fascinating. Yeah, and it makes me curious because I remember my nan speaking about French patois and I'm like, what is that? It makes me want to speak to her about that. And I just think the way that languages have evolved, like here, is just fascinating. Um, so the Creole here, loosely based on French, and then there's all kinds of other things mixed in. I think you can have an all-inclusive package here. And I think it would be like the best all-inclusive experience you could ever have. Like the food is amazing. Some hotels, they really like lessen the spice because they think we've got loads of tourists and loads of Brits that can't handle the heat, but they don't, they don't lessen the spice. So the food is really good, really good quality, really fresh, really tasty. I love it. I'm gonna try and eat as many meals as I can today. So we're gonna chill and then we've got a late flight. So it's good, we get to have a full day here practically. I need to get some more content. On this trip, they haven't said like you have to do four Instagram posts and three blog posts and blah, blah, blah. 
like it's quite open uh, and I know that even if I say there's no deliverables it doesn't mean I'm not going to do anything yeah I can be a bit more chilled and maybe just create enough content for one blog post and a few instas so that is the plan and I'm going to make the most of my last day we're now at the tropical attitude for the day it is so nice oh I love the rattan furniture. This bar is really cute as well. So cute. <laughs> gorgeous, gorgeous. This place is so cool. It's an island where you can just chill. And yeah, we're here for an hour and then we're going to another island for lunch. I'm gonna go to the craft market and see what I can find. If you need a beach bag, this is the place to come. Uh, for your lunch, you will have a complete plate with your chicken fish, sausage, a salad, you have cabbage, salad and carrot. Mm. It's okay for everybody? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Use your hands. Yes. Ooh, okay. right. grow banana and pineapple. I'm gonna miss this place. It is so beautiful and delicious. Girl, I wanna make you mine. I need to be with a woman like I <laughs> So we've just popped to the Tropical Attitude Hotel. It's so beautiful. I'm gonna freshen myself up. Right, so I'm all freshened up. I tried to take some pictures with my tripod, but I just was not feeling great. I just, I don't know, I'm still quite insecure. Even though I've been doing this for 10 years. Sometimes I'm insecure. When you're trying to take pictures of yourself, you just have yourself to like motivate yourself. I know this is, you know, I'm not saving the world. Just gotta remember that. No one thinks what I think. No one sees what I see. Maybe in a few days I'll look at them and think, they're all right. But I just had a bit of a, a wobble. Uh, I better, I need to write a postcard to my grandparents. I always try and do this when I get away and I haven't done it on the previous two trips. So I'm determined to write them a postcard and post it because I have had to post it from the UK before. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna join the others for our last meal. <laughs> Hello. Oh, the rain isn't that, that bad. And I've got a bag on my head. <laughs> but long before Columbus came, people lived here on the island. These were the Arawak Indians. 